Hey, it's been a while. It's actually been a real long time since I touched this game. Over six months, I think, uh, unless I'm remembering correctly, a lot of stuff's happened. For one thing, I probably sound a lot better because I got a new mic. I know, awesome, right? I've also done several Let's Plays since I last uh, did a recording of this. Uh, such as Spyro will have started by the time this video comes out. Uh, but let's not talk about that. Let's talk about this game specifically, because of course we're playing it. Why wouldn't we? And more specifically, oh shoot, I think I went to the wrong one. Hang on, hang on, hold on, hold on. This is not the right. Nope, 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 nope. Ignore that, ignore that. That's not the right zoo. Hang on, I know. I forgot continue just reloads the, pre the preview zoo that you were just playing. Oh boy. Wow, this is off to a great start. <laughs> All right. Uh, okay. Let's uh, let's put a pause on this because I gotta remember what on earth I did the last time I played this. Because again, it's been a hot minute. All right. Apparently, our ticket price is too low. Uh, we can fix that real quick while I'm thinking about it. Let's raise that to twenty-one. Yes. Okay. Uh. Since the last time I played, uh, there's a lot of things I've learned, specifically, to, uh, to, uh, help your bigger buses be able to, you know, get around faster, you should actually remove the smaller buses out of rotation. Did not find that out until, like, later, unfortunately. Um, so what we're going to do is we're actually going to remove all of these buses, the little tiny buses, and we're actually going to, we're actually going to destroy all the little buses so that they're not wasting space. There we go. So now all we have are the second tier buses. So hopefully that will help speed things along and we don't have so many people not getting on the bus. At least that is the hope and the understanding I got when I was looking it up. Another thing I figured out is uh... What you want to do... Uh... Where are you currently selecting? Okay, so here's what we will do. Because what I, what I found out also is what you want to do is you want to have the zookeepers ha be zoned to habitats that are next to each other, which I have not done, and this really needs to be fixed, because holy smokes is things all over the place. Because that helps them be more efficient when they are going around trying to feed all the animals. See, like, that last one, uh, Samara had one over here, one over here. That's not helpful. So we're just gonna actually temporarily unassign everybody and then we're going to reassign them to zones next to each other so we're gonna have you here and you here then we will have you here and here put you here and here you here and here you here and here and then this is where it gets tricky because I think we have an odd number of habitats.
We do. We do indeed have an odd number of habitat. So what we will do is put you here and here. Then we will do you here and here. You here, here. Here, here. Here, here. Uh, then probably here. Here? I do think I had one specifically not zoned. So everybody has two now. I will probably reorganize this in a future date when I have more habitats. But I believe the goal I'm going to try to do is have two, empl um, two employees have two zones at a time. That way that hopefully makes things uh, go a little smoother. I have all of my janitors zoned how I think I want them. My farmer... I didn't know my farmer could be dedicatedly zoned. I think I can only have one farmer at the moment. So I'm just gonna leave her not zoned at the moment. If I had... Uh... If I had more than one farmer, I probably would zone them so that they all uh, they uh, focus on one thing and, and specifically at a time. So I will uh, I will leave that be. Let's go see what we can do. Oh, hello! The London Zoo actually has something we can do. We could. Turn in one of our ducks, I believe that's one of the ducks anyways, and get a pair of cows. I think the cows can be used for something both good and bad. Like, I think we can sell the milk from the cows. So, that can be beneficial. What else do we got? And the shelter, nothing is particularly new, so nothing worth it. In the Australia, oh, we could get donkeys. Hey there, mate. Great to see you. Do you want to trade for a pair of donkeys? Yay or nay? That is an interesting way to spell... Is that actually how you spell the plural for donkeys? I thought it was... D O N K Y S, not D O N K I E S. Is, is that really the plural? I don't know. So here's the question Do we want cows or do we want donkeys? I'm kind of leaning towards the cows. I think we've actually had. Well, no, actually, we've had the donkey trade since the beginning of the game. So. Chronologically, I think we should get the donkeys, but I believe the cows could be more beneficial to us. So, I think we need to make a cow habitat somewhere, which will take some thinking. I mean, we have a bunch of money, we just scrapped a bunch of buses, so we could do it. All right, we now have a decent sized plot for cows. And I also extended the path a little bit. Uh, I decided to make this a three by whatever here. I also made a little bit larger here as well. Uh, but it does shrink down to a three by. But let us go get our cows. We only have one of these duck, but that's okay. We can probably breed for another. Or pick one up from the shelter. Oh, we got a bonus cow! Do I have a... Oh! I must have a perk still active from, like, the last time the, uh... My zoo got a health inspection from the animal inspector. 
that must be a perk I still have. Not that I can remember that, because again, we're talking about six months ago. <laughs> but yes, I will be more than happy to uh, take that. Two wonderful cows, more like three, are on their way to the year zoo. Please look after them. They are gentle, friendly, and intelligent, so try to think of them as more than burgers on legs. Great, now I'm hungry. Thanks, game. I kind of wish the bonus cow had been, like, uh, a female instead of a second male, but, eh, well, I think we will uh, be uh, just fine. I'll probably put another longish sort of uh, habitat here. Actually, you know what? Let's let's actually do that right now. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Hang on, hang on. What what habitat do the donkeys need? They need a desert, really? Okay. Did not know that. What is here now that the cows are gone? You're just talking about geese. So the geese are giving you trouble. Can't say I'm surprised, but you have done a spooky job of looking after them. I'm guessing we're done with the London Zoo for the moment. Wait, was there a... No, I think this was here before. Yeah, the Maricots aren't new. Was the Oakland here before? I don't know. <laughs> Maybe. But that get, will give us an opportunity to get bears. Which need the mountain habitat. Okay. What, what is this one? Penguins. Okay. This one was armadillos. And this is bee. No, that's not a beaver. Oh my goodness. I, I thought that was a beaver. Nope, that's a that's a platypus. Okay. So the I guess the donkeys need a desert habitat. Did not know that. Here we go. And then we will put that there. It's another couple hundred um, used up. Yeah, I know I need animals. Chill out. Are you specifically complaining about this habitat? Because I haven't... Yes. They must have tweaked that because it used to complain about a habitat until the animals were actually put in. So the fact that it doesn't now must be an update that they did. Oh, we actually have a couple of options. Uh, let's get rid of our spare... Wait, which one's older? Eh, let's do the older female. And we got a bonus donkey. Okay, cool. So I hope you are happy with your new... ...ass. I, that That's not a swear. That's not a swear. We're talking about the actual animal. I think people will come for miles around to look at it. Oh yeah, I gave you a pair of them. Well, that's great. Just look after them, won't ya? And we'll put our new asses, as he lovingly called them, into our new desert habitat. So what is here now? Oh, kangaroos? Ooh. They are mighty and they are fighty. It's the good old roo. Look, I don't know what you heard, but these animals are top fellows. I'm not literally trading what... Aussies consider pets for a beautiful flamingo. Nah, me, it's all above board. You say? All right, let's actually start the day. It's literally not done. Any I've literally not had the day go at all <laughs> since. Uh... Oh wait, 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 wait. Hang on, hang on. Let us. Let's actually zone uh, Kenya so that they take care of this. Something else I just remembered is uh, there is no water for those habitats. So let us fix that real quick. As soon as I remember where on earth the water pump is. Um... 
sure. And since we can, let's just upgrade this. I like how um, I scrapped all my small buses and their big buses still, or, or rather the small buses are still <laughs> picking up people. It must have been a weird queuing of uh, the buses or something. So let us add some yummy yummy water. Pop that water there. Then we'll grab this war base and then pop it here. Oh, that's right. We have a new shoulder type. I legit forgot about that. I might swap some of the shoulder types with this new, more realistic shelter. But first things first, let us pop these ones there. There we go. That'll work. I'll probably tweak some of the scenery and some of these habitats once I have more options. But I don't really have any right now. Alright, let's just resume. Hi, why are you here? I'm pretty sure I've kicked you out of this zoo how many times now? Anyways, so I, I probably should just show this off. You can back out of these. So if you ask for, um, to pick up some animals, basically what they do is they give you hybrids, very expensive hybrids, I might add. So, and then if you try to sell, it's, uh, they'll give you a set amount for each, each animal or whatever. But, uh, no, we're gonna just report you to the police again. Like, we have for, like, the tenth time now, I think? I- I have long since last track how many times we have kicked them out. I came here to see crossbred animals. I'm pretty sure you probably have seen at least one. Speaking of crossbred, do we actually have anything in the crisp? No, we do not. Okay. That's fine. Do we have anything in here? Oh, we do. We have a breeding pair of badgers and a breeding pair of rabbits. I must have been working on trying to progress the more family lineages. I also apparently had somebody... Oh. Animal is reward. Say hello to Brit. I'm assuming in the duck hat. Yeah, okay. Something I might do, probably, because it is getting a little hectic. Is uh, a I should probably check to make sure everybody has food. It just dawned on me. Uh, I don't know what everybody's food supplies is. Hang on. So I think we're fine. But what I do think I'm going to do is I believe I'm going to apply contraception to all the pens so that they only breed in the breeding program. And so I just don't have, like, so much, uh, breeding going on randomly. I think I'm done donating animals, I- I think. So, honestly, by this point, I think it's more beneficial to do it this way. I'm gonna pause, because everybody's leaving, and I'm not quite sure if I want to actually end the day yet. Okay, apparently I have uh, the copybars already on contraception, not that I remember this. Same with the snakes. Was the geese on contraception? Yes. Okay, so I guess I had some of the habitats on contraception already. Did I have the rabbits on contraception? I have a bunch of rabbits getting too old. That's not good. Okay, yes. Alright. I might have let the horses keep the way they are. Because I want to say they don't have too much of a chance to have offspring. And pregnancy takes a really long time, so I'm not currently worried about the horses. So I'll probably let the horses go. Monkeys, I probably should put you on. Yeah, let 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 
let the monkeys finish their pregnancy. I think I have a... Don't I need to... Yeah. If I recall correctly, I have a requirement that I need five horses. So yeah, I will let them continue to try to breed and hopefully one of them will give birth to uh, another horse and we can complete that task. But everything else I think is fine. Let's just let the day finish because I think I have everything the way I want it at the moment. Day E5, we made a profit of 5,000. We currently have 15 uh, K. Uh, 617 people could not fit on the buses. Okay, so that kind of makes me think we need more bigger buses, which is uh, fair. I'm not quite sure where the thing is with that. These poor animals look so bored. Are you kidding me? They have so much stuff going on. How can they be bored? Oh, uh, hey, look who showed up. Oh, there is a habitat that needs more enrichment. I need to figure out where that is. But first things first, let's get everything good and hunky dory with the donkeys. So, what I did find out not that long ago is like, you do probably want to use some filler because it, it helps with your pricing and such. But still. Hey, those uh, carrots are finally paying dividends. Nice. Yikes, that is expensive though. So we got them sorted out. Where am I lacking in enrichment? Uh, oh, the ducks. That's not surprising. There's way too many ducks in here, honestly. I also would really like to change the shape of their habitat, but I don't really have anywhere to naturally shift them towards, so that is definitely one of the things I would like to fix. So this, what this is telling me, just at a glance, and I'll need to check this again later, is we need to bump up Horizon Village a little bit more. Factory District and Riverside Suburbs are desperately in need of more buses. Either that or I need to actually upgrade again. That's another possibility. Which currently I'm not sure if I can do that yet. Let's see. Now I gotta try to remember what I already have unlocked. Oh! Lake pack. That must be where they introduce uh, Lake, the aquatic decor. Oh, hey, there's the barn. Get milk from your cows. The mor morally right way. Unlock two more farm pack. Increase the vegetable processing speed by five percent. So yeah, I was correct. There is a barn for uh, the cows. Not entirely sure where I put one, but hey, it's there. And I believe you can sell the milk. I don't think any of your animals need milk. Though, can you use the milk for the ice cream shop? I actually don't know. I do gotta say one thing. Some of these upgrades are getting really expensive. Economically, we probably want uh, the barn. Oh, it's a good thing we did the barn because I just found the burger shop I've been looking for for who knows how long. Unfortunately, it's 18 points, so I can't get it. Oh, uh, well. So what's, what What do I need next to get this plot of land? How much? 20,000. Okay. So that is definitely going to take some time. Probably once I get this plot, I will actually probably throw in our subway somewhere around here. Oh, we had... Sweet. Another badger. I don't think that's a badger I need, though. Oh, I just had a thought. The day changed, so that means new stuff should have showed up. Pretty sure this, yeah, they don't have anything new to say. Uh, ooh, we got our horse. I will take that. 
we'll pop this here. So now we have another horse coming. Sweet. Was I planning on upgrade uh, expanding the snake habitat this way? I must have. I'm not sure why else I would leave that spot the way it is. Oh, we got a lobbyer rabbit. I that's the new rabbit. Sweet. But, okay. So does that mean I was done with that pairing? Uh, yes, yes I was. Let's return these guys. What do I need next? So I need to combine this Harlequin with this... Whatever this is. Unfortunately, I think my only one of those I have is too old to breed, so I probably need to clone another. But that looks like that would be the next realistic combination I should look into. What about birth? Right, okay, that was the last duck. But let me guess. Yeah, that's what I was afraid of. Of course. Of course. Oh. There it goes. There it goes. Day 86. We made 7,000 with our current cash of 22. We could actually afford another plot of land. I'm not sure I want to do that just yet, though. 1,100 people. The f Okay, so our, our people that do not fit on the bus is is going down at least slightly so we are making progress on the buses 